Hi everyone. Um, I observed that the last case study scenario I uh, put up on the channel was very well received by the viewers and the subscribers. And many of you actually put your answers or your responses to the case study in the comment section. I was very happy to read it uh, because case study scenarios, uh, they help us to understand how the rules of the road that we learn using books can be applied in a real life case studies. So based on that today, I will discuss case study number two, a new case study. And I would like to see uh, or rather read your comments again. So let's get started with today's case study. In today's case study, there are two vessels. We will call the blue vessel your ship and we'll call the orange vessel a cargo ship. Now in stage number one, your vessel is rounding a headland and it is approaching a waypoint for an alteration of course to the port. Now you can see the waypoint has been shown by the letters WP. Now while your vessel is at stage one, there is another vessel or a cargo ship at stage one, which is approaching the headland from the other direction. Now the cargo ship sees your port aspect, the port aspect of your vessel and it alters course to starboard as the giveaway vessel. You are at this stage unaware of the alteration carried out by the cargo ship. And so you alter your course to port to follow your designated passage plan. You want to stick to the requirements of your passage plan and don't want to deviate from it. Now, both ships are in position number two. At this point of time, I would like to know from you what action should you have taken, your ship should have taken at position number one. That is my first question. My second question is what action should your vessel take now at position number two. And my third question on my last question is, is there something wrong that the cargo ship did? Tell me about it. So if you want to hear my analysis, my analysis is available on the members only channel. So if you want, you can join as members, but otherwise I want to hear or rather read about your analysis of the case study and see how you would have reacted to this scenario as your ship as well as if you were on the cargo ship. So keep watching and thank you guys for subscribing, for watching, for supporting this channel and sending so much love my way that really encourages me to put up more videos that helps with your learning. I look forward to your comments and feedback. Bye.